Wow, can you believe it has already been 12 weeks? I have absolutely loved joining you on this journey and I hope it's been both meaningful and impactful to you. Real quick, I just wanted to offer a recap of our time together and then a few next steps. So all the way back in week one, we started in the book of Genesis and of course we've just finished in Revelation. So how crazy is it that we've worked our way through the entire biblical narrative in just 12 weeks? Since the beginning of time, God has had one specific plan, all culminating in the person of Jesus Christ. And his plan has never changed. No matter how badly we mess up, God's plans still progress forward. So even today, as we live out the mission of Christ on earth, we witness his presence and experience his supernatural hand at work. You know, I've seen many Christians become discouraged and overwhelmed by the cares of this world. But aren't you glad that life with Christ is characterized by joy and hope? And also community. We have brothers and sisters all over the world who are walking right alongside you, some of which have been part of this Forerunner experience. So let us walk in unity, regardless of age, race, or standing. And let us run with perseverance the race that has been marked out for us. Let us go first, leading the charge and setting the standard for culture. My prayer for you has been and will continue to be this, that these 12 weeks wouldn't just be another discipleship experience, but instead that they'd become a launching pad from which you in your ministry would be propelled into orbit. Forerunners, this is only the beginning. And now you may be wondering, what are my next steps? Well, fortunately, this is why you have coaches. They can help you navigate through those next steps. And that's what they're here for. Even though the experience is ending, they'll still be available to answer any questions or help you on your journey. Be sure to click that red continue button and, and read through the material provided. There's several options available, whether that's walking through the credentialing process, attending the IMC ministry intensives, or participating in a summer internship. But once again, this is only the beginning and we can't wait to see what God will do through you in the future. So on behalf of the Pentecostal Church of God and the International Mission Center, I say well done. Your initial sprint or the warm-up lap may be coming to a close. You've run hard and you've run fast, but now it's time to reset, to put your feet back into those blocks and begin your marathon. Thank you for joining the movement. Thank you for stepping up for your generation. And thank you for running with us.